I say we blitzkrieg the fort because I do not have much time. All right, I will go to sailing then. Royal crest, like the toothpaste that I never use because I use Colgate. Mm. See, I bet you were going to think I said I don't brush my teeth. That would be a lie, a deception. That's good. I'd hope you brush your teeth. What are you, my dentist? No, but do you want to look like the characters in this game? Yeah, I think that'd be pretty cool. Ah, we're tipping. It's this way, Gary. Which way? This way. Ah. See, you now you're going the wrong way. No, I think I'm going the right way. No, you're going the left way. Oh. Full speed ahead, Gary. Well... I would, but, uh, no wind. They will never find me right here. <laughs> <laughs> I am not a bear, or I am actually a man. Oh. It was a disguise, Gary. Oh, wow. Oh, this one's active. Which means... Um, we can attack it. Which means... Money. Which in turn translates to... Clothing. Which gains us... Fashion. Which will serve the purpose of... Making us look cool. To the end of... Whatever the lore of, of the end of Sea of Thieves is. Which will inevitably lead us to the conclusion that... Ends this game. Oh. Which, uh, also which would leads be... to us being fired upon. I see. Well, it seems like we skipped right to the last step, Gary. Don't worry, Gary. I'm going in. Alright, is there a dock on this? I didn't look. On the right side. Alright. There's also a ladder right in front of us. Alright, we're gonna start. Ah! They're still shooting cannons at me. <laughs> Guys, I'm unarmed. I'm holding a coconut. I'm not holding a banana, but it is still the same. Oh, it is occupied by ghosts. Yeah, phantom ghosts. I shall shoot the ghosts with my gun. Okay, I'm gonna repair the ships so we don't sink. I am killing ghosts. I did not know this was possible, but it, it seems to be a thing. I am fighting conquistadors. Yes, they are Spanish forts. I hate the Spanish. I know. That's why we invade the fort. I have made it. There is a hatch. Oh, well, let me get over there. Underwater area. Hold on, let me get over there. Don't explore. I... Okay, I will not. Welcome, Getty. Oh, our friends have arrived. Yes, the meetings are now commenced. How are our, uh, how are our uh, annual stocks looking? Mm, they look to be good. They look to be transitioning everywhere. I am sitting like I'm constipated. <laughs> I am constipated. I'm jumping down, Gary. Wait, there's another hatch here. Secret entrance, Gary. Secret entrance. Ah, yes. I found the upper area to your secret entrance. Mm. We need a prison cell key, Gary. Alright. We need a fortress treasury key, Gary. Okay, we get that at the end, I know. Is that a donkey? No, it's a gate. Oh. Oh, I found their sleeping quarters. Oh, they don't like me in their bedroom. Oh, I found a key. They don't like me ringing their bell. I found a key, Ethan. Gary, they don't like me ringing the bell. 
I stole the key to the dungeon. The sex dungeon. Yes. Let's go. Is this is this the key? Nope, that's prison cell. Nope, what key was this for? Wait. Storeroom key. Where's the storeroom? Uh, it's the room with the stores. Oh, of course. Okay. Oh, the captain's here. That is interesting. Oh, hello, Captain. Captain of the Fortress. That's an odd name. Yeah. <laughs> is this it? Oh, it's at the top of the building. I found it. You know what I found? Do you mean to come down? A bunch of, a bunch of bullet holes in, in me, nonetheless. Hey. Treasury key. I know where that is. Oh. Okay. Oh, we can take the gold from behind. I know. Is that it? That's it? I mean, they did say these were for quick adventures, I guess. I want to find the prison cell key. Well, now what? I don't know. I'm going to keep searching for this key. If it's even here. Hey, Jerry. Yeah. I have a bomb. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm not going to be able to get back up to you in time. Got a blast. One of these days, Gary, I will hit it. Alright, well, you do that. I'm just going to... Oh, did you actually Gary, get it? Gary, I hit it. Oh, um... Gary, what are you doing? Get out of here, Gary. Get out of there, I said. Gary! Get... Alright, I'm out. Alright. Now it's time to leave without you. No. What? Dang it. You know, I don't I don't believe in such outlandish concepts as currency, as mm -hmm. Property. As, as, do we as want... a piece of paper saying that you own this land and therefore I cannot do anything with it. All right. No, Gary, I, I do not subscribe to such ideals. I'm, I'm what you call an anarchist, Gary. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this C and I'm gonna shove it up the, the, the developer's peanut ass. And once I do, Gary, once I do, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. I'm gonna do it again, and then once I do it a second time, that's when I will do it a third time, and then once I do that, Gary, I'm going to, uh, well, um, uh, well, you see, that's when I'm gonna, uh, uh well, uh, probably play Elden Ring. Yep, makes sense. There is a brig over star. Hmm, let's just see. Well, they are doing their thing and we're heading to an outpost. We are heading to an post out. A post of outing. Which is what uh, the post young Stony Malone says when, uh, he, uh, when he's leaving a place. He says, post out. Mm. Because he's Post Malone, baby. <laughs> uh, you know what they say, Gary. What do they say? Yeah, you uh, give a man a fish, and he uh, he has a fish. 
but he, he you teach a man to fish, and uh, he doesn't have a fish, as as the old proverbial saying goes. Gary, uh. and, uh, and I think that could uh, gleam a lot of uh, wisdom to our our younger uh, posterity of the of the United States, Gary. Mm. And, uh, if you if you pay close enough attention. We'll see that we're missing the outpost. No, I'm just and, going to the uh, dock. And, and, that, and that's um, what that what that means for us is that uh, well, uh, it means America's dying. Oh. Gary, this is the wrong dock. Well, that's where we. How far I have to walk? That's just this outpost. What do you want from me? Longer legs. Give me your legs. No, I like my legs. I'm gonna graft the top of your legs to the bottom of my legs so that my legs are two legs each. So what, you have like four knees? Yes. Five. Five? If you include the high knee. Hmm. Get it? Get it, Gary? Is this the... It's like butt. Hmm. Yes. Hey, that's an interesting hey. thing to see. What's that? A <laughs> brig's coming our way. Hey, that's not normal. Oh, I thought the brig just disappeared. It did not. Well, they're either coming our way or they're heading... Well, they're coming our way either way, but they're also barrels. Ah. It seems that uh, we have a fight at hand. Yeah. Very... It seems that there's trouble afoot. Time to get prepared. It is time to get uh, prepared, Gary. Yes, we only have bananas as food. Yes, but I can eat your legs if need be. Uh, well, they're here and they're raising sails. And they're on cannons. Oh, they passed us. You're so stupid, you couldn't pour piss out of a boot if the instructions were written on the bottom. Yeah, how do you like that? Yeah, that's what I thought. Get on out of here. Yeah, yeah, you, you, you so-and-so, you dingus. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah. I think I scared them off here. Yes, I think I provoked them. Huh. Did ya? <laughs> Mm -hmm. uh, maybe get on board. <laughs> no, Gary, we finished what we started. They're going, they're ramming, Gary. And by that, I mean, I mean, they're ramming the ship, not you. Oh. Gary, that was not the time for heroics. Now is the time to sell. I gotta make money. I'm a businessman. Gary. Oh. I sniped their cannon man with my sniper rifle. Keep shooting, Gary. I sniped their other cannon man, Gary. Are they both down? Yes. Alright, can you get back and repair quickly then? I can try. I'm just laying into their ship, so... Firebombs. They did. No, you throw firebombs. Oh no, it's down. Oh. We did it, Gary. We're I... better than it. Yeah. You hear that? We're better than you. Oh, he's on the road load. Oh. Oh, all the... oh that's a lot of loot. Hit him. I don't have any ammo left. Did I harpoon him onto the ship? No, I just sniped him. He Let's did? get their loot, Gary. All right. Ship's repaired. Wait, did you record the part about me talking about the frog? I don't know. I've been recording for the past hour and 30 now, so maybe.
You ever heard of a jet vac, Gary? I think so. It sounds familiar. What do you think it is? Well, I think it's like a right. it's like a kind of vacuum. Yes. I mean, yes, it is. Yeah. It's it's more than that though. It's it's a truck with a straw attached to it that uh it's is used, a vacuum. It's a vacuum for cleaning big jets, right? No. We were cleaning a storm pipe area and there was a frog sitting in there. And you know, he's running away from the nozzle <laughs> and like uh he's coming out toward me. I'm like, "Oh, hi frog." And uh you know, instead of like grabbing the shovel and trying to scare him out of the pipe, I stood there, Gary. I stood there as the nozzle came out at the end of the pipe, and he ended up behind that fucking... It's, it's like four pressure washers on the back of this thing. He ended up behind him, and he's just flung back into the depths of the pipe, presumably to be sucked up by the vacuum. Uh, no! No! Uh, yeah. It was tough. <laughs> If, if you did, you should animate that. Let's show them how we do this. Let's start the show. I don't want to be how everybody else is. I'd much rather be original. Let's show them how we do this. Let's start the show. I don't want to be how everybody else is. I'd much rather be original.